Uh, the theme of the event is just like presenting to the community, community and having uh, university administrators and officials uh, reveal what we've been working on here, what they've been working on here, and what they partnered with Johnson & Johnson for, which is the 3D printing lab. So 3D printing is similar to a glue gun. So you have actually a, a thread, a spool of thread. It's going to be either plastic, Kevlar. We have tons of materials to do that with now. Carbon fiber is one that's really exciting for us. Um, and we thread that through to an extruder, which melts it and goes through the nozzle. You're printing off each layer at a time, and you're, then you place it on top of itself. And that's how 3D printer, 3, most 3D printers actually work, is they just go layer by layer by layer by layer until you get the final product. Um, as students, we get to use them with our classes uh, for things that are strange shapes, or we, can't, we don't want to buy 100 bolts, we can make one. Things like that we've been using them for. It basically makes it so that you're unlimited in what you can do with, like, at least engineering-wise. You're only limited by your imagination and, I guess, your printer's capabilities. With these machines, we can actually build joints and hips. It actually brings in a lot of different engineering disciplines, and we can take those disciplines and build whatever we want. If you can custom print a knee for somebody, chances of your body rejecting a custom fit implant is so much smaller. Um, so that's that's the that's the biggest opportunity I think that uh, a lot of people in 3D printing are pursuing. Uh, this lab, just different material printing and different material testing is a big thing as well. So. I wish it could be open to everybody. Um, I hope that we could do small labs or classes where we can bring people in to see how it's done, how it works. That this is the future. I mean, 3D printing is really going to become very popular. And um, being able to introduce the whole world to that, you know, we wish we could bring more people in.